guys welcome back to my channel I have a tiny little haul for you guys today but the main thing that I wanted to show you was what you just saw I have exchanged my pretty planner for a simpler one so simple I am loving it and as you can tell, this is very pretty. This is what I was using as my Bill's notebook. And very shortly, it got super thick with all the stuff that I had to do. I found myself carrying receipts, all kinds of stuff in here. And whenever I had to put this in my purse, it was really a hassle. It was just a lot. So, I went to Barnes & Nobles. I was not looking for this. It just found me. <laughs> I wasn't looking. And as you can see, it's super cute. But it's super thin and practical. I want to show you what I did with it. I think I paid um, less than 15 I think it was probably... 12 or 14 dollars and it's pretty basic all it has i don't know if you can tell but it has 2017-2018 embossed in it yes there's two years worth of this and the good part is that it started in march but i'm not going to show you because i already started i want to give it a try um but i will show you i will show you April it we haven't well it's gonna start pretty soon but what I am going to do here I am going to put down any finances Etsy shop included anything that has to do with money bill payment Etsy shop paydays money being spent anything being sent out financially is gonna go in this notebook I did it already in March um, and this is my little setup for April and what I ended up doing okay this pretty notebook has a monthly view between now and 2018 guys <laughs> and it has a map some area codes international styling toll free numbers and websites for I don't know what oh this comes Sandy UPS South Cargo FedEx credit cards airlines whatever and then it has a notes section and what I did well as you can tell I added a tab so when I close my notebook I'm able to see it right away with the notes pages work and the way that I'm going to use this is, is practically half the notebook is the calendar and half the notebook is notes pages so what I did I washi taped the pages for the month I just did it until December so I did it per month and I put wash different washi tapes her pages um, and what I'm intending to do let's say I am in October and I needed to make a note page for October what I'll do I will go back here and I'll put the same washi tape I put on the monthly layout and I will put it in the notes page right on the side so if I'm looking sideways if I'm looking for it it will match on the side um, what I also did I made a pocket I cut this out from a magazine that I was reading it looks like this it was literally a cutout um, this comes off um, I'm not sure what it's meant to be but what I did do, I made it into a pocket. So I placed 
glue on the sides and I literally just glued it together and I glued it on this side and it is holding my receipts for now it's just the money orders that I've purchased and they're just sitting here for quick reference before I file them away I had an extra one from the same magazine and it's just sitting here for now um, I did put pockets in the back I don't know what I'm gonna use them for but it's always nice to for me it's always nice to put pockets in here what I did I just glued them on again in there um, I put some decoration in the front and that's about it I I'm I am really trying to simplify my planning style. I am seriously trying to simplify a lot. So I want to have all my finances together in one notebook. I, I like that it is a notebook and it's not, it's not rings. I need everything to stay in one place. My Erin Condren is like my Bible and I have everything on there, but I think finances should be separate from everything else i don't want to have to look for this book for this and look for the i just want to have it all in one place like i said my other notebook as pretty as it is i love it i really love it, it it's just like too bulky for me like for bill payments and stuff i just i'll try to repurpose it for something else but for my bill payment it's really not working for me right now i don't know if I might change my mind, but for now, I am going for a much simpler notebook. And this is what it's gonna be for now. Oh, of course I had to be cute. <laughs> and I made it, it came with a bookmark, but I made it, I put this nice little charm at the bottom. It is just super cute. I had to make it a little girly, really girly, because this pink is just awesome. It's like my favorite shade of pink. And what I do in the monthly, in the month that I'm on, and for a quick reference, I open it up and it's right there. So, for now, this is what I have for my finances. And so far, I did it for the month of March. And so far, it's so good. So, I'll try it again for the month of April and I'll see how it goes. And as always, if I have to change it up, I'll change it up again. Okay, the next item that I wanted to show you was this set that I got me in Michaels. They had a very nice 60% off. And this set was retailing for like $30. But I was really dying to use them in my bullet journal. Cause you know, I'm trying to, I don't know if I want to make a video yet, but I, I've been playing a lot in a bullet journal. I have a play bullet journal. And it's this one right here. I've been loving this a lot. Well, I was doing something, so it's so marked. So I have this one here, but this is the real one that I'm gonna be using pretty soon. And I went and purchased this and I put it on the spine to make it look pretty. So, but I I wanna I wanted to give this a try to and when I saw that there were 60% off in Michaels, I just ran and got it. So thank you so much, Michaels these paper mate flare but these are limited edition they call them the candy pop they're super pretty and i they have six new colors i have a bunch of these but these are really good these are really good um i think i paid like 24 dollars for them yeah and i hope they're worth it but there there is 24 pens here so I guess it's a dollar per pen whatever I I really like them they don't bleed and they're very good in my Erin Condren I haven't tried them in my bullet journal yet but I really like these and I was able to get them they're limited edition and I didn't want them to go away so 
yeah and talking about limited edition hold on one second <laughs> You guys, oh my god. Yes, this was also limited edition. And I just wanted to get my hands on it before they went away. Because I, I, it happened to me once. And it was limited edition, the product that I wanted to get. And I just, you know, I figured that I could get it whenever else. Because they would probably bring it back somehow. But it never came back. So I learned my lesson. So if I want something and it's limited edition. And I really, 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 really want it. I am going to get it. So this is a copper metallic bullet journal. I know I haven't even started my real bullet journal. But I just had to get my hands on this before they went away. They had them in gold, silver, and this copper is just amazing. I, it was so pretty, I just had to get it. Oopsie. Next up, I have me this pretty paper clip from Posh Pieces on Etsy. I, I really like her stuff. They're really well made. Oh, this one is not. Oh. Okay. Well, they're really well made, very nicely. I don't know how she does this, but this is really pretty. So I went and got me this coffee girl. So pretty with the glitter and her bow. I'm not sure why it's not packaged, but um, I had me this nice Easter hat. And this pretty makeup brush. This oh my god. Should I zoom? Yeah, let me zoom you in. Cookie, right? I love her attention to detail. Look at this. And here and the glitter here. These are really pretty. This is one of my favorites. Look at this bunny ears. Oh, I love her stuff. Love her stuff. Now, if you've been watching my videos for a while now, you would know that I have tried really hard to not go too crazy with sticker shopping because I. I it was a problem. Well, it is. Well, I think I have it under control right now, and I don't go and buy tons of stickers anymore. And what I'm trying to do is just use what I have, and then I add things every now and then. So I've been doing very, very, very good. But I've had to get me these. <laughs> these are from Two Little Bees. This is super. I already went and used this in my one of my planners, but the colors, you guys, so springy. Is that even a word? I love. I love. This is one of my favorite colors right here. These are washi strips and full boxes. I had to get them, and this is in glossy paper. These are matte. And they're just as pretty. They just feel different and they probably write differently, but I don't care. I like this clipboards and half boxes and the days of the week. And this is so pretty. I had to go and get me two of these. And the coordinating washi strips. And this is a sticker, you guys. This is a peelable sticker. It's so pretty. And yes, I got me two of those too. And this sampler sheet. I love that feather there. So pretty. I love like rose gold, everything. Beautiful. And the last thing I want to show you is my order from Rose Color Days. Yeah, Rose Color Days. And these are just headers and I want a headers because I have a lot of inserts that I haven't used in my personal planner and I'm, I want to use it I really want to use it and what I'll do I will just cover up the dates and here's a closer look Alright guys, and this is how I am going to end this tiny haul video. I 
hope you liked it. I am also hoping that I can inspire you. If you make whole videos, I would love to see your videos as well. Please link your channel down below and I would love to check that out. So I want to also thank you for all of your sweet comments that you leave me. I love reading them. I love communicating with you guys. And don't forget to like my video because that is how I know that you guys liked it. And that inspired me to make more videos for you guys. As always, I will post more pictures in my Instagram page right here. Just remember that they also offer discounted codes in their Instagram pages. So that's what I do. I would check and see if they have a discount code or if there's like a sale going on. I would try to purchase them during the sale so that I could save me a couple of dollars. <laughs> Alright guys, so I hope you like my video. Alright, so subscribe to my channel if you have not already and I will see you in my next video. Bye now!